We want to solve the equation x plus 6 divided by 10 plus x minus 4 divided by 15 is equal to x plus 2 divided by 6. Since this problem involves fractions, the easiest thing to do is going to be to find the least common denominator of these fractions and multiply through by it so that we, have, we get an equation that does not involve fractions anymore. When we look at the denominators of 10, 15, and 6, we get a least common denominator of 30. So we're going to multiply every term by 30. 30 times x plus 6 divided by 10 plus 30 times x minus 4 divided by 15 is equal to 30 times x plus 2 divided by 6. So when we cancel the 10 with the 30, we get 3. So we have 3 times x plus 6 plus canceling the 15 with the 30, we get 2 times x minus 4. Canceling the 6 with the 30, we get 5 times x plus 2. So we're going to solve this on the next page. 3x plus 18 when we distribute the parentheses plus 2x minus 8 when we distribute the parentheses is equal to 5x plus 10 when we distribute the parentheses. Now we're going to collect like terms. 3x and 2x is 5x plus 18 and minus 8 is plus 10. That equals 5x plus 10. At this point, we realize that the left-hand side is equal to the right-hand side without any further simplifications, and we can write that this is an identity. In other words, this is a true statement for all values of x. So the solution set to this problem is going to be all values of x, so we will write negative infinity to positive infinity. So the solution to this equation is all real numbers, all numbers from negative infinity to positive infinity.